Another day and still Birmingham police pleading with the public for their help in finding three year old Camille McKinney, the toddler who was kidnapped Saturday night from a birthday party. Lee Peck in the studio tonight with the update and Lee earlier tonight, the police chief talking directly to the person or persons who may have her. Well, he did, Lenise. It's now day four. Investigators continue to follow every lead in search for Camille. So far, no luck. But the chief today calmly looking into the cameras and pleading with the person who holds the key. It was thought to be the break in the case Birmingham police were looking for in their search for three year old Camille Cupcake McKinney. Acting on a tip, tactical teams surrounded this apartment complex earlier today. False reports going out that Camille had been found safe. A brief sense of relief dashed when police confirmed the child is still missing. That if you know something or you have any information that might be important to us, or any information that might help us move forward with this investigation, that you please step forward and provide anything that you have. In his latest appeal to the public for information, Birmingham Police Chief Patrick Smith speaks directly to the person who has Camille. I want to just talk to you for one second. I want to give you safe passage is the way to go. Please bring her to one of our fire stations, police station, a hospital. If you don't know what to do or where to go and you're frightened, we're here to help you. Our goal is to reunite this three-year-old baby with her family. I want to reiterate what the chief said because we need to make this very clear. We have one focus here, and that is to bring Camille back to her family. You can hear the sound of our voice. We're speaking directly to you. Help us find Camille. If you have any information, please call. One of those calls to Crime Stoppers. In addition to the $5,000 offered by the governor's office, the Crime Stoppers reward is now up to $20,000. You know, a lot of agencies don't pay a reward until the conviction of the offender. At Crime Stoppers, your tip only has to assist law enforcement in solving that crime. We approve our, our rewards weekly, so you could literally call with your tip today, pick up your money in cash next week, and you're totally anonymous. There's no better deal in town. Meanwhile, two persons of interest in the case, Patrick Stallworth and Derek Irisha Brown, remain jailed tonight on unrelated charges in the case. Lenise.